Many scripture stories are stories of deliverance mm -hmm. because the, the scriptures are trying to teach us these true principles that God delivers the faithful and that the miracles happen and that we can be spared. But the scriptures are not silent on stories of not being delivered. If we turn to Alma 14, there's a very famous story. The main inhabitants of Ammonihah were so wicked that they burned them. They burned the, the wives and children and scriptures of many of the converts in Ammonihah. Behold, the Lord receiveth them up unto himself in glory. And he doth suffer that they may do this thing, or that the people may do this thing unto them, that the judgments which he shall exercise upon them in his wrath may be just. So Alma offers us one explanation of perhaps this is why God has allowed this horrible thing to happen. Sometimes we don't have an explanation for why bad things happen to very good people. This, I think, is where having a foundation centered on Christ really matters. If you trust that God is trustworthy, that can carry you through the discrepancies between different outcomes. There's not much we can say in the face of a lot of really horrible tragedies. But if we are centered on Christ, we know that He is trustworthy. We know that there is life after death, and that foundation can anchor us even through really horrible scenes like this.